Hello everybody, McGregor here, and welcome to Battlefleet Gothic Armada 2. So, uh, I was able to get hold of this game thanks to uh, the developers, and uh, I have played a little bit of this game, and it is amazing. Basically, you control um, ships in the uh, Warhammer 40k universe, and yeah. <laughs> That's all I need to say. I love, I'm a big fan of Warhammer, if you guys don't know. Um, I have a few 40k armies and a dwarf fantasy army. But yeah, um, let's just quickly go to battle. I just want to show you the races in here. We got the Imperial Navy, Adaptus Astratis, then the Mechanicus. We got Chaos, then we got Eldar, Dark Eldar, Orcs. Necrons, Tyranids, and Tau. They're missing one that... <laughs> my, my favorite army is the Grey Knights, which aren't here. And I'm sad about that, but oh well. But yeah, you have different factions. Uh, they do have Space Wolves, so I'm happy about that. So, yeah. So we're going to do a campaign. Now, I have done the... I have done this just to get an idea of how to play the game. So, we are going to do the Imperium. Uh, there's also the Necron and the Tyranids, at least in this uh, beta, which is actually a work in progress, so keep that in mind. Uh, yeah, I think we're in the second version of it. So, everything you see here is not finalized, so keep that in mind. I was going to play this earlier, but I had a kid. So... <laughs> I haven't played this really here, so we're just going to do the regular campaign on normal. The Imperium of Man. A million worlds scattered across an uncaring galaxy. A million worlds forever under threat from the machinations of cursed traitors and perfidious Xenos. It is an empire consumed by war by the very battle for survival itself, for there is no peace amongst the stars. The Space Marines, genetically modified warriors who know no fear, spearhead every counter-assault, taking the battle to the heart of the foe. From the smoke-wreathed horror of Adeptus Mechanicus Forge Worlds sail warships of fearsome potency, their weapons blessed by the Machine God, and their crews dedicated to the Omnissiah's holy cause. The Scholar Progenium molds callow flesh into leaders, officers of the Imperial Navy, the greatest fleet ever to span the stars. These heroes dedicate their life to the Imperium's defense, confronting the ceaseless threat of chaos wherever it manifests. The war against the Dark Gods and their worshippers is the eternal battle for the soul of mankind, for the future of the galaxy itself. It is the forge upon which true heroes are struck and legends are tempered. Admiral Spire is one such legend, savior of the Gothic Sector, vanquisher of Warmaster Abaddon's 12th Black Crusade. For centuries he has been lost, trapped in the shifting tides of the Immaterium, while in pursuit of the hated foe. Such travails would drive an ordinary man to madness, or into the clutches of the very gods he once opposed. But Spire is no ordinary man. And his time is coming once more. We're out. Praise the Emperor, but I can see the stars again. Receiving distress signals. The region's alive with them. According to the timestamps, Admiral. The year. It's 999M41. We've been lost in the warp for over 800 years. And Cadia, the hymnals report that it's been destroyed, sir. There's a lot of confusion out there, sir. And Admiral, Cadia fell at Abaddon's hand. Then we are returned not a moment too soon. Navigator, chart a course to the Cadian system. 
We may be an age too late to join the battle, but revenge is still within our grasp. Warp engines online. Gela Field holding. This is Admiral Spire to all Imperial vessels. Rally at coordinates 154-554. This isn't over. Such turbulence. No. Not since the Eye of Terror have I felt anything like it. Wait. This is not the Cadian system. Navigator, report. The Immaterium writhes, Lord Admiral. It has flung us far off course. I can see that, Domitian. Where are we? Star sights indicate we've entered real space in the Cadian sector. Confirmed. Not too far, but not close enough. Still, we have been fortunate. Have our astropaths send out a hymnal. All surviving vessels in the sector to rally at our position. Cadia needs our aid. Warship signatures inbound, Lord Admiral. Chaos vessels. Indeed. Then our retribution begins. We hold this position. What is this I smell? Another so-called warrior come to chance his blade? I am Lord Admiral Spire. I will be your death. Not this day, Lapdog. My lieutenants come to claim your skull. It shall adorn the War Master's throne. We shall see. Ready main batteries. There we go. I've never actually played the first one. Oh. Coordinates acknowledged. Changing course. Cruising speed set. You're lucky. I was going to ram you, buddy. Come on, guys. Chip looks pretty cool. So is ours. Is he hiding again? No, he's not. Let's try to move him closer. Seem to target his stuff. Do I have to do this? No. Engaging engines. I don't want to use these on him. Heading acknowledged. You haven't even gotten through my shields, man. Underway. He's dead. <laughs> Admiral, the sons of Mars stand ready for your orders. Excellent. Their firepower will be a great asset. Well met, Fabricator. How many ships do you bring me? All that could be found, Lord Admiral. I regret that we bring enemies on our heels. Duty breeds enemies, Fabricator. Join your fire to ours. We'll see them ended. Nobody's questioning that this guy's, you know, like, back. Utter the canticles of battle! 
Weapons calibrated. Sit down as priority one, and you'll be priority two. Understood. Engaging target. All right, we got increased range. much about these ships just yet like the weapons they have and all that course engaged understood okay let's just continue on coordinates if acknowledged i can Heading acknowledged. Oh, I'm right beside you. Look at that. Marked our ships. I don't know what that means. Oh. Those shots just went right through me. I could assault you. Yeah, let's do that. Gone. Targeting enemy vessel. Hit. And there he goes. That's the last of them, my lord. Negative. They were but the tip of the spear. I calculate that the others will soon arrive. It matters not. I led a fleet through the bleakness of the Gothic War. By comparison, this is nothing. A pity that war cost us our greatest heroes. But I wouldn't give to have Captain Abradol at my side. All decks report ready. Good. We shall forge new heroes this day. Let us hope they suffice. Seems they've come in strength, Lord Admiral. All ships. The Emperor protects. Engage at will. Survival probabilities are unfavorable. Recommend we withdraw. All ships, hold position. Doubt forms the path to damnation. There is no doubt while strength abides. Beneficent Emperor? Is that what I think it is? The Sons of Dawn heed your call. Lord Admiral. <laughs> it's good to see vessels of the Adeptus Astartes, Captain. Faith is well enough, but hope and faith bring victory sooner. The war never ends, Lord Admiral. We shall fight it together. For the Emperor! Go. You can go after this guy. Salt them. Oh, 
see, I don't think they have a flagship, so that's fine. Let's go with that. Initiate targeting protocol. Sure, stop. Might as well go over here. Oh, they got turrets. Speed you up too. Okay, slow down and let's send in the assaults. Underway. Let's quickly turn you. Cruising speed set. course send in some more at your command standard speed engaged rouse the engines Heavy casualties, okay. Repositioning. Okay, you're critical. We're gonna keep you Changing right course. beside. Battle protocols engaged. Underway. You have fire. Setting course. <laughs> oh, it's sick to be you, man. We have fire. Deal with that Order right away. Engaging. Weapons destroyed and everything destroyed, else. Lord Admiral. No further signatures. And allied ships. Nothing more. Others may be inbound. We can wait no longer. Let stragglers seek our trail amongst the dead. We have a fleet. I must confer with Lord High Admiral Drangas how best to employ it. We will have vengeance for Cadia. The challenge before us is bleak, but we shall prevail if the Emperor wills it. The Despoiler will be driven back, but we need support. We must secure planetary systems within the battle zone. These will provide us the necessary means to strengthen our fleets. Okay, this part is new to me. Uh, da, 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 okay. Threat level. Okay. Oh, I don't want it to fill up. Okay. Artifacts. 
Demios Binary has much to offer our future operations. But it is occupied by Chaos forces. We shall sweep them aside and restore the Emperor's rule to this stolen world. Drove it. Okay. Fleet. Okay. I think I understand. There's a lot of, like I said, I never played the first one, so. your skills okay so I need to move Spire's fleet there will be many risks in the days to come I need not take one here Deploying a second fleet to Demios Binary will ease our victory. Why not just deploy them all? We outnumber the foe. Victory is all but certain. But caution must serve as well as haste. Recklessness is a terrible master. Oh dear, hi world. What's this? Oh, can I call in people? Oh, that's cool. I'll call in you guys. <laughs> I want him. Sorry, I couldn't. I can't add him. If we can only move through a system. No, I can't click on him. Doesn't look happy. Top will be deployed first. I can be deployed due to leadership. One day will be replaced. Okay. Okay. Ten thousand years have passed since the galaxy burned in the fires of the Horus Heresy. Ten millennia since the greatest of the Emperor's Primarchs fell into the grasp of eternal damnation and tore the galaxy asunder. Horace Lupercal may be dead, his body ashes and his memory the stuff of a cursed legend, but the wounds he wrought yet gape in the hide of an embattled Imperium. For the battle against chaos knows no end. Many of Horace's servants survived the civil wars and they have not forgotten their defeat. When the War Master fell, they retreated to the Eye of Terror and waged battle anew. Greatest of these was Abaddon the Despoiler, Horus' greatest living heir. Abaddon took the title of War Master for his own and embarked upon a long and bloody campaign to succeed where his fallen master had failed. Twelve Black Crusades he launched against the Imperium of Man. Twelve world-shattering campaigns to forever alter the balance of power. Now, as the millennium draws to a close, a vast armada of traitors slips its moorings as Abaddon launches his thirteenth and perhaps final strike. As the tide of chaos breaks against the Cadian Gate, 
The Imperium holds its breath. Faith alone cannot hold back these bleak waters. Only valor will serve. sure what's at any of these sections you can hide in some of these areas asteroid field there I admiral understood We wait your command. Race for impact. No more or less from asteroids and all that. To serve the Omnisire. Thruster routines active. Ship ready. Engaging engines. The enemy has seized a strategic area. Oh. Machine spirit appeased. I didn't know that's what we had to do is capture points. You have seized a strategic area. Course engaged. You have seized a strategic area. Okay, we got two. There's one over there. We're getting another one. Where, here, just a quick. Oh, there's the other one. Okay. Understood. I admiral. Let's come up Underway. this way. Maximum burn. Cruising speed set. Optimal course set. Receiving your order. Enemy sighted. State your order. Heading at You go out over there. We are ready to serve. Reloading. State your order. There you go. Transition begun. Target on screens. We serve. Your orders? You the come enemy down has in here. A strategic area. Your command. To serve the Omnisire. Ship ready. Engaging engines. Setting course. Come on. Changing course. Send in some more. 
Receiving your order. Engaging target. Okay, you know what? No, no, no. Burn retros. Machine spirit appeased. I admiral. With matchless efficiency. Okay, we're winning this. We serve. What's this? To serve the Omnisire. Accumulated 25% of strategic points. Good. The spirits obey. Calculating vectors. You have seized a strategic area. Receiving your order. Engaging drive. With matchless efficiency. You have seized a strategic area. And All ahead, full. full speed ahead. Your orders. Coordinates acknowledged. We are ready to serve. Target locked in. You are gonna come in all the way over here. Engines. Ship ready. Yeah, yes, yes, problems now. The enemy has accumulated twenty-five percent of strategic points. Let's get his generators. State your order. I don't know what that does. <laughs> uh, onto the crawl, can't throw moves in a straight line, take damage you can. Huh. Sticks to an enemy ship. You have accumulated 50% of strategic points. Receiving your order. And oh, that was a miss. I admiral. The enemy is seizing one of your strategic areas. We are ready to serve. And I think that's it. Victory! Well, let's see. Renown. Okay, ships get experience. That's okay. Bonus skill. I think he reaches experience level and his fleet move point will increase by one. Sweet. First victory is ours. Others will follow should we remain true to our duty. Battles leave scars. I must be mindful of my vessel's condition. The reclamation of Demius Binary has taken our enemy by surprise. The Claustrum system is exposed. We shall push our advantage. If the fleet is to grow, we must have access to production facilities. If Claustrum falls to our forces, we shall have them. Okay. Uh, may spinners take some off your ships. Do so. Let's let the fleet. Okay. And they roll fleet to this system. This 
So then we take control. Okay, and then we do an end turn. But I think I'm going to leave it here, guys. Um, wow, that's a bigger system and a lot of ships over there. But yeah, anyways, thank you all so much for watching this episode of uh, Battlefleet uh, <laughs> Armada 2. I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have enjoyed, don't forget that like button and subscribe if you'd like to see more of this game. I, I want to do a couple of... Um, of, uh, of videos of this. I wanna, I wanna see what this game is fully like, but yeah. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.